And welcome with the summary of WTV News. The House of Representatives held its meeting and uh, the chairmanship of Hassan al kabi first deputy of the House of Representatives. WTV correspondent said that the agenda of the meeting includes the first reading of the draft federal civil service law and discuss the report of the committee of regions and governorate are not organized in the province about the Baghdad Provincial Council. This and the agenda was free of the vote on the draft budget and the completion of the governmental cab. Sairon Alliance called on the Prime Minister and the Finance Committee to cancel Article 14 of the General Budget Law. Sairon Alliance, uh, during a press statement, uh, during a press conference uh, confirmed uh, that this article will allow the sale or investment of any institution or government company, pointing out uh, that this represents a lack of reservation of public money. Prime Minister Adel Abdel Mahdi presented to Parliament a new candidate for the Ministries of Education and Justice. The channel perceived a document issued by Abdel Mahdi said that the candidates for the position are Safan Hussain Ali Al Hamadani for education and Judge Arkan Qadar Wali Karim Bayliani for justice. Noting that uh, the names uh, have been audited uh, by accountability and justice uh, and integrity as was checked uh, with the national security. MP for Sairun Alliance of Badr Zayedani Alliance confirmed that the Coalition of Construction and Reform and Reconstruction will not vote on the new candidate of the Ministry of Education, Safan Al Hamadani, for the existence of some observations about her. As they had said, that the Parliament is still looking for information on the candidate of the new Ministry of Justice expected to pass it in case of presenting him in the House of Representatives. Also, the Governor Raid Council voted to reconvene the session, which witnessed the vote on the current Governor Mohammed Al Mayahi. The Council said in a previous statement that the Council had decided to suspend the powers of Al Mayahi and to authorize Ad Zarkani, the first Deputy Governor of the Province Administration. I think that uh, these measures uh, will continue until a new governor is elected. The commander of the popular mobilization in Ambar province, Qasim Muslah, revealed uh, the presence of provocation to the forces of the crowd by U.S. forces within the aim of dragging them into fighting. Muslah said that the U.S. forces are launching a program that aimed at arresting leaders in the popular crowd and targeting positions belonging to them. It's interesting that the security situation in the sector of popular crowd is safe, stable, and controlled. End of the summary. Thank you for watching.